So for this project we're going to need a 1 inch by 8 inch piece of black iron pipe, a 1 inch to 1 quarter inch reducer, a 1 inch to 2 inch reducer, a 2 inch coupler, that's for attachment to the forge, a 2 inch to 3 quarter inch coupler, or a T, a quarter inch street elbow, a three quarter inch to quarter inch hex and two two inch nipples. So to seal all the joints we're going to use Loctite 565. It's a thread sealant. It's better than uh, Teflon tape uh, to hold up to propane. To make the burner we're going to take the 1 inch pipe, attach it to the 1 to 2 inch reducer, attach a 2 inch nipple to the 1 inch to 2 inch reducer, then attach the 2 inch to 2 inch to 3 quarter inch T flat iron pipe fitting to the nipple, and then after that the other 2 inch nipple. Then the 3 quarter inch to quarter inch hex bushing. The quarter inch street elbow. And then to the quarter inch street elbow we're going to add a piece later. To the end of the black 1 inch pipe we're going to add the 1 inch to one and a quarter inch reducer. We will need to file down the one inch to one and a quarter inch reducer so that it will fit into the two inch coupler. Once the reducer is filed down, it should fit easily through the 2 inch couple. A coat of paint will keep it from rusting, but don't paint the 1 inch pipe all the way up to the end because that is the part which will get hot. This is a Parker Hydraulic BST-N2M fitting and it's used to quick connect the propane source. Depending on what kind of propane source you're using, you may have to thread it into the quarter inch street elbow or find another way to attach it to the burn. Here I have a needle valve as well as a quarter turn ball valve for propane control. Here I'm using a 2 inch to 1 inch rubber connector that I found at Home Depot so I can attach a piece of vacuum pipe to the blower to act as an input for the forced air. To use the burner, all you have to do is attach a source of propane as well as a blower for the force there. Once you have the mixture right, the burner should 
burn by itself with no outside introduction. That's it for the build of the burner. The rest of this video is just showing the burner flame as well as uh, the flame without the one inch to one inch and a quarter reducer and showing it, it doesn't work without the flare.